Okay, let's take a look at the surface area of a hemisphere. Now, what it isn't, it's just not half the surface area of a sphere because what you have is the curved part, curved area, plus the circle. So let's go ahead and put some dimensions in. Okay, so let's say radius equals three. Well, what is this? let's let's break it up and do the curve part first. Okay, we'll call that one and two. Uh, well, for this we are going to use the uh, formula of a sphere, so that was um, surface area of a sphere that was 4 pi r h, uh, sorry 4 pi r squared and but we are going to um, divide this by 2 why 2? Well, we only need half of it, so let's cut it in half. This means that's what we need to do to find 1, which is 2 times pi times 3 squared, which in this case is 9, 18 pi. Now let's leave it in exact form and um, We'll, you can do any rounding later on. Okay, so let's work on 2 now, which is just the circle. Radius is still 3, so area of the circle is uh, pi r squared, pi times 3 squared, which is 9 pi. Now if we put it all together, the surface area of the hemisphere is equal to 18 pi plus 9 pi. Now this is units squared, uh, which is 27 pi units squared. Uh, what is that to, let's say, one decimal place? Well, it's going to be pretty close to 90, 30 times 3. So let's have a look. 27 times by. We'll make that approximate. Okay, squared, which is 84.8 units squared one decimal place.